Hey guys, it's 360. Now, some people have commented on my post on Amino about the Splatoon font. And R I know R11 Game said, How did you get that font? I would like to have that on my phone. Well, today I'm going to show you how to install the Splatoon font on your Android device. So this is, right here I have the Galaxy S4. This is my daily driver. And it works great as of 2018. It's also it's also fast on it's also fast on your high speed data, and it is kind of fast with the data thing, because as you can see, I'm on AT and T. This is an OtterBox case, so it's pretty durable with this case on, and it has a and it has a screen protector on it. Comes with a case, so yeah. As you can see, I as you can see, you can tell by the font. Like you see how the font is. You when I scroll down right here. In fact, I'm gonna go to that amino page right now. So here is my amino, and I just wanted to say also thank you for we're almost getting to a hundred, two hundred followers. So very happy that I well it's kind of odd, uh, odd. Sorry, I'm kind of stuttering. It's really odd that I have more followers than subscribers, but hey, I don't mind. So I'm gonna go scroll down to the first post. That I did. See, I see Splatoon font from my Galaxy S4. It has it has nine likes on it. As you can see right there, this thing would freaking focus. Well, I don't know if it's gonna focus on its own or not, but I hope it does. So, come on, camera, focus. I'm just gonna put it down. Why won't this thing focus? But yeah, he said, what app is that? I would love to put this phone on my phone. So I'm going to show you that. So what you're going to want to install, well actually before I, before I do this, this is only going to work for LG and Samsung devices. If you have a device like ZTE or Motorola or even the Google Pixel, or if you have a phone that won't that won't uh, that won't allow you to change fonts, or it doesn't have built-in fonts like the Samsung phones and the LG phones do, then your then your device will have to be rooted. But if you have an LG or a Samsung device, then then you don't have to root your device. So you're gonna you're gonna want to install High Font, as you can see right there. It looks like that. It's free on the Google Play Store, and you're gonna also want to install ES File Explorer. So let's go ahead and get to the font page. So you're going to want to go to the Project Paintball font page. Um, you're going to want to, where it says download now, you're going to want to go to, you could either do one, but I suggest Mediafire since it's a lot more easier with Mediafire. You're going to want to click on that. You're going to want to click on that. And then there's gonna be multiple full there's gonna be multiple files. The one that I have is the paint is the paintball beta three TTF. You're gonna to want to do that. And I'll put a link in the description so that way it'll be a lot easier. It's gonna redirect it to the download. There it is. But like I said, I'll put I'll go ahead and put a link in the description below, so that would be a lot easier. Once you have the font downloaded, you're gonna wanna. That's kind of odd. The color kind of goes out of adjustment whenever I go too far. Well, because it's so bright now. You're gonna wanna go to your file explore. You're gonna wanna go to the file explorer. Yes, file explorer. You're gonna go to that. Surprise! The chat group is kind of inactive. You're going to want to go to your internal storage. And then you're going to go to your down. So there it is right there. You're going to want to You're going to want to you're going to want to hold it. And then you're going to want to extract it. You want to hit extract to. And then you're going to hit that. But I already have it extracted, so yeah. And then you're going to go to your high font folder. And then you're going to paste it in there. And 
Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open up the Hyphon folder. We're going to open up the Hyphon app. By the way, this Galaxy S4 is running on Android 5.0 Lollipop. I wish it was running 4.4 .4 though, but it runs good though. Then you're going to go to your settings, I believe. And then you're going to go to your my font. And then you're going to hit scan. Alright. Hold on a second. Now you're going to want to... You're gonna want to scan it, and then you're gonna. You're, it should pop up though. And then you're gonna install it. You know they say you could swipe it to move it, but that's just a lie. You have to still tap it. This is the same thing on like 4.4. .4, so yeah, you're gonna go to your. You're gonna go to display or wherever your font thing is. And you're gonna go to font style. And then it should be here. It should be like that. And then you should. And then you're gonna select that. And then obviously I already have it on mine. So yeah, that's basically how you do that. So I hope this video helped, and I hope this video helped to the members on the Amino that that commented. So yeah, thanks for watching.